Um, my name is Cameron Batkin, um, and I currently serve as the Field Youth Coordinator for Australia and New Zealand. And at the moment, I also have the privilege of being the Regional Chair for the Regional Youth Council in Asia Pacific. So I guess the first role for leadership for me within MRI was I was an assistant youth leader as like 17 in my local church just after I became a Christian. And then I served on the District Youth Council at 19, um, served on local youth councils and then became a local president, um, served as the district vice president for a number of years in the late 90s and early to mid 2000s became the district youth president in 2005. And then in 2011, I became the district president again on the Australian North Pacific district as it was then. And then I became the field youth coordinator in 2014 till now. And yeah. So yeah, I've, I've done lots of jobs at NY. I've had the privilege of seeing NY um, have a huge impact on young people's lives over decades now and in lots of different ways. So um, sharing the good news of Jesus with them, but also trusting them with leadership. Um, and I think that's probably the takeaway that I've had with NYI is the ability for young leaders to um, develop and grow uh, and, and sort of find their feet underneath themselves um, so they can become better leaders over the years. It, it changed who we were as a church. It helped us realise, and I remember there was a classic thing that happened uh, early on. We had a church board meeting and someone came to the board meeting and said, I don't like these young people wearing baseball caps um, in church. And we were bracing for, you know, the barrage of abuse. And then they said, but then God showed me that I should be really grateful that the church is full of young people who want to know more about him. And so that was one of those pivotal moments in my leadership journey to, to realise that young people have a really important place in our church. I definitely wouldn't be where I am, I think, in the church. I don't even know if I'd be in the church if it wasn't for loving youth leaders and pastors giving me opportunities to serve and to trust me. And I think and why um, is why I got my first set of church keys that someone entrusted me with, with ministry for others. And so, um, yeah, I definitely wouldn't be where I am in any way, shape or form without um, the trust and love that was shown me through and why.